so hello guys this is um Afikbo road so after the Afikbo road this is a shopping mall you just go straight as if you're going to Afikbo the next place we are going to pass is the Nkwego cantonment and you're going to see an army checking point yes this is the place then after that we have the international airport flyover guys they are building new flyover for us here it is after this flyover junction that we are gonna get on okay so welcome back again to my channel is your girl helen Konko. if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe okay for my returning subscribers god bless you or oh, god bless you i really appreciate your like and shares this is a airport junction if you're going to airport you take that way that i just showed you guys so but we are going to on okay definitely we are going to pass this flyover Oh, this vlog, I'm so excited to bring it to you guys. You, sir. Whoa, this is dusty, you know. Onoeke is the ancestral home of the Iza people. Guys, it is in Onoeke that the Iza ancestral home is located. And every Iza man, wherever he is, once in a while, Either their elders or them themselves find themselves in Onoeke to pay homage or to visit their ancestral home. It is located at Iza South local government area of Ebony State. Okay? and uh, not quite far from the international airport Eza is the northeastern Igbo subgroup in the southeastern nigeria that's west africa of course is one of the most populous clan in Nigeria with 22 communities and over 3,000 villages. Is that you can find them in Enugu, you can find them in Benue State, you can find them in Cross River, but majority in Ebony State. I heard but not too sure that you can even find them in Lagos. I don't know if this one is true. Please, if it's true, drop it in the comment section. If you're an Izaman from Lagos, please drop it in the comment section. Let us hear, okay? But the unique thing about the Izas is that last, last, all of them, their ancestral home is at this Onweke. to be direct descendants of Ezekono and his wife Anyego, therefore called Eza Ezekono. Eza no kweba, ndi Eza neba, to kwe hu, unu di kwa ho ike hu. Now, did you hear that this is majorly how the Eza is great? The Izas are grouped into two. The Izi Quarrels, who occupy the southern part, and the Papajis, who occupy the northern part of the land. Guys, if you are an Izi Quarrel or you are a Papaji, please drop it at the comment section, okay? we visited we saw the ancestral home we saw 12 stools in the ancestral home made of uh, concrete and then we are going to bring it to you in subsequent vlogs if you're still not subscribed to this channel what are you waiting for please click the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell beside it so you'll be notified anytime I upload a new video okay Life. 
the Isars of the olden days were mainly known to be businessmen, headers, warriors, and then farmers. Okay, they are also known to be wise and crafty. During the slave era, in a Ebony state, it was Iza and Afipo that had a slave root. Okay, though I don't know if they kept history to that, but if there is, with time you're going to see it in one of my vlogs. It is said that because the Iza people were majorly warriors, they were employed by many communities to fight for them. And after the war, which they always will know, we are given a share of the land they fought for as a means to repay them for their own blood that was wasted during the war. And this is how Eza Ezekuno people came to live in all the senatorial districts of Eboin State and even cross to Enugu, Benue, Ondo, Cross River, Anambra, Lagos, and other states. I heard that there are in some about five villages in Abia State too. How true is this? Please drop it in the comment section. Let's hear more. So, guys, this is a um, eco road in Eza, that is Onweke exactly okay and it's along this eco road that the ancestral home of the Eza people is located guys so just enjoy the vlog as we ride it's just that the place is dusty and the dust now made the camera not to be very sharp again everywhere was so dusty but let's keep going <music> So guys did you notice they are grading this road hmm hopefully before christmas maybe the Ezars, the honorakes the amodas and lots more <laughs> they are going to drive on a quota who knows let's watch and see the road you can see some edifice still on construction but those safe will not even allow you guys see it very well so guys if you learned anything new in this video click the like button share drop your comments tell me what you feel make your contribution and then see you guys in our next video bye bye love you guys this is our ancestral home yeah yeah thank you for watching Helen's Kana.